Okay, so when did you guys get started building? You say you've always been builders. Is it something you did like as, as kids? You kind of helped out with, uh, with projects or did it come later in life? So I mean, we grew up with my father, grandfather, you know, family all building, you know, working on our own house, working on camps. Um, and then, you know, we all went to college. I went to school up in a Bar Harbor College of Atlantic. Sure. Ashley went to Orono. Ryan went to UMF. Mm -hmm. So, you know, we all have degrees in different stuff, but we kind of came back to building. And then we were working on a project in Wayne together, a timber frame. And my daughter's friend's mother works at Kennebec Land Trust. Uh -huh. And she knew the production company, Dorsey Pictures, out of Denver, Colorado. Right. And they were looking for carpenters in Maine to do a show with that fixed up old camps. Hmm. She knew we were carpenters, you know, kind of put us together. We did a couple of Skype interviews and, you know, that's here how, we are. here we are. So the idea was already formulated um, by, by the production company in, in Colorado. Um, it sounds pretty specific <clears throat> though, camps in Maine. Was there something appealing about Maine to them that you know of? Or, or did, did your personalities kind of sell them on the idea? Um, I think the beards kind of sold them on the idea. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, not Ashley's, of course. <laughs> but, you know, normally as contractors, we go in, finish a place, and then let the homeowners decorate and all that stuff. Sure. But what's different is we take these to complete finish. Yep. And you know, they can look good for TV. How's the feedback been that you guys have heard so far uh, in the first season plus that you've done? It's been super positive. Super positive. Yeah. I've answered probably, I don't know, 10, 20 emails a day of wow. people, yeah, just so excited about the show, um, asking where they can find a camp, um, asking us to fix their camp up. It's just like, it's kind of snowballing. Yeah. And it's really cool for us to see. And it's also, um, it's cool for us to see, for me personally, probably you too, like the production side of things. Uh -huh. yes. Like we're there all day long filming um, and we get so sick of them. <laughs> <laughs> no offense to you guys. <laughs> oh, don't worry, these folks get plenty sick of me, <laughs> don't worry. <laughs> oh yeah, it goes both ways, that's for sure, that's for sure. Um, um, so that piece of it must be entertaining for you then to kind of go through that whole yeah, process. Yeah, so when we watch it, we're watching it at the same time everybody else is. We don't get a sneak advance of it. So it's cool to see, you know, the job that they do and how they I mean, do that, it. That's the power of it. It's the power of editing. Mm. I mean, we're... <laughs> <laughs> Take note, you know. I mean, we're, we make mistakes. We do stupid stuff. Sure. But they put together such a good story that, I mean, they could have painted us in many different <laughs> pictures. That's the truth. The footage is there. Believe me, the footage is there. You better watch it. It's going to come out one of these never, days. 